we got to know that the sperm fuses with the egg to form a zygote and this process is called fertilization so during this process the sperm will swim towards the ovum and our ovum will have a layer called zona pellucida so when the sperm comes in contact with this zona pellucida the ovum will induce some changes in its structure these leads to the blocking of additional entry of the other sperms see how organized these cells are like if a sperm comes in contact with this ovum it will undergo some changes just to prevent the entry of additional sperms this will show how beautifully they have following this mechanism let's recall the structure of the sperm it has a acrosome a head a tail also so when you zoom in the structure of this acrosome it contains a fluid like substance so this fluid will contain many enzymes now what is the function of these enzymes here so the enzymes which are present in the acrosome will helps the sperm to enter into the ovum why we need to use the enzymes here why can't it enter directly why because when you observe the structure of this ovum here it has a layer called zona pellucida along with that we can also see a plasma membrane so when the sperm wants to enter into this ovum these two layers are acting as barriers so we are using this enzymes which will helps the sperm to enter into the ovum directly by diluting or digesting these two layers so now we got a free entry right so directly the sperm can enter into the ovum and can leads to fertilization